Hello people this is self tuts and we are continuing our series on docker for beginners and in this video we'll see that how we can view the docker containers which are present on our local machine so basically we can create multiple containers from the same image or from different images so we can have container x container y and container z on your local machine so there can be n number of containers out of those containers some containers can be in running state and some can be in stopped state on your docker machine the containers can be in running state or can be in stopped state so docker client provides us both the command where we can filter out or where we can see that which containers are in running state and then we can see all the containers both in running state also and in stopped state also so when when we want to see that view or uh, view all the containers which are running and non running then we can use this command docker ps so basically you can say it uh, sim it is similar to the process command we can say docker ps and then hyphen a which means show all the containers which are in running state also and in non running states also or in stopped state if you want to see only the running containers they can then you can just use the docker ps command let's see this in our terminal so we'll go to our terminal here and we have already docker installed here and there are some containers which are running so i have already started a container called mysql container which is in running state and there is another containers which are in stopped state so let's first see the command that is docker ps hyphen a so let's run docker ps hyphen a and you can see that it gives us the detail of the containers so we have container id the image from which this container was created the third column is the command we'll learn about this in detail in later videos then the fourth column is the created which means when this container was created so this was created 5 minutes ago and the hello world was created 8 minutes ago what is the status when we say up 5 minutes which means that it is still running and when we say exited which means it has stopped then the ports are there which we'll learn in the later videos and the names so names are uh, names given by the docker host to your container some meaningful names if you have not provided docker name in your run command then a automatic name will be assigned to that particular container from the docker daemon so basically this is the details when you use the command docker ps hyphen a and it shows both running container also and the exited which means the stopped container also let's see the second command that is docker ps and what it will output so it is docker ps and here you can see that only the running container are being showed so basically in the docker ps hyphen a both the containers are present which is in running state also and in exited state but in docker ps you will be able to view only the containers which are in running state so docker provides you with both the command and you can use it whenever you want so hope you like this video hope you like my channel please subscribe to this to the channel and please share these videos with other people thank you